Hello, happy Friday. Uh, welcome to 1996. Jinx, you weren't even a thought at this point. Uh, today I'm going to be streaming a game that I haven't actually played all the way through, but I, I do have a soft spot in my heart. Sailor Moon! Oh god, my, uh, browser is playing shit at me now. Okay, so which is... <laughs> I, <laughs> I have, uh, a chat in the, uh, open on my laptop, and so it's just playing the stream live. That's cool. Alright, so without further ado, let's unpause this emulation, uh, and I'll... There's, there's gonna be, like, a little intro to it, and I'm gonna have to read it out. So, I think, uh, we're gonna do that. Uh, he comes from far away. I have no idea who this he is, by the way. From the depth of the darkness, he continues to wander. Soon the void of the darkness is interrupted by something. If you, if you watch the show and you don't know what's going on, I don't either, to be honest. I think this is a game thing. He refers to Sandal. Yeah, okay. The darkness is shone upon by the light. The light covers the darkness, and the darkness is no more. This is some Kingdom Hearts bullshit right now. Then the light and the darkness... Are one. The light makes light, and the dark makes. Dark. This really does sound like Kingdom Hearts techno babble right now. I seek the darkness, and before long, Jake, stop seeking the darkness. Come, on, come over here. He and I will become one. <laughs> this is how babies are made. <laughs> Oh. 30th century Crystal Tokyo. So okay, we're okay, 30th century Crystal Tokyo. This is the future of Sailor Moon. Um if that makes sense, where she's like queen and bullshit. Astronomers of the 30th century have discovered a significant celestial object. Approaching Earth. <laughs> I, I forgot the uh, Sentences are going to get cut off here. It's determined to be a meteor of enormous size. Everyone watches in fear as the meteor continues on a collision course with Earth. Yeah, that one star cloak. Man, that one guy in the corner, the right corner, he's fucking jacked. And while all this is happening, Oh, are we gonna get, like, uh, voices? An epidemic has begun to spread among the people of the city. Meanwhile, several youths have banded together to form a vicious gang. I don't know what voice I'm doing for this. In search of answers, Neo Queen Serenity, that's Sailor Moon, begins to pray to the legendary mystic silver... Crystal. Ginshuzhu. <laughs> that's a Japanese translate. So there, I'll, I'll have a bit on translation in a bit here. <gasps> I'm having so much fun with this. Why is the Gin Oh, wait, this is Sailor Moon. Who's talking right now? Why is the Gin Shoshu vibrating so wildly? Gin Shu? How do you pronounce this? Evil energy has appeared, Sailor Moon. It must be incredibly powerful. I'm assuming that's Diana, the cat. The Death Phantom has dealt- How do I do Sailor Moon's voice? Which, which season of Sailor Moon do I do? The Death Phantom has dealt a powerful blow. Huh? The Death- The Death Phantom is a new enemy? The era of great peace is finally over.
It was bound to happen sooner or later. I feel like I'm playing dolls to myself, like back in the 90s. <laughs> this is a very serious matter. We must call upon the Sailor Senshi! This is a very long intro. Hey! Hey, what? The Gensoshu has stopped vibrating! Strange! I for already forgot the voice I did for Sailor Moon. <laughs> the visions of the disasters to come have stopped. The ominous tremblings, what do they mean? Undoubtedly, this is in some way related to the comet. Could it be so? Yes, it must be so. <laughs> How long is this intro? The great peace of the universe must be protected using the power of the... I can't suck in that. Gins... I'm just gonna say silver crystal. <laughs> Ginsuishu. Ginsuishu? Ginsozo? I don't know. The new silver millennium must remain. Get, come on, give me that start screen. Oh. Let's go! I don't I don't know which which one of these. Oh god, they just ran out of there. <laughs> Pazuzu! <laughs> Elder sister, are these the girls we're looking for? Uh, he he. he. <laughs> She's gonna have a deep voice, I think. Certainly, this is what we were sent here for. This must be where they live. Should I spy on them? It is our destiny. Or, wait. I'm assuming it was... <laughs> yes, we must try to make Lord Apsu's wish come true. Man, she got some hot pants. It is destiny. Why are you doing that alone? You're gonna die doing all the voices? I am gonna die doing all the voices. Princess, I, like my sister, vow to make our destiny come true. Who's the princess? <laughs> Chibi Yusa, what is it? I just had a vision from the future. God, everyone's gonna be such an annoying voice. I'm so sorry. Yay? Yay? So what's it about? Was your boyfriend in it? Ooh, she's your mom. It was about Mamo-chan. That's a uh, tuxedo mask. Idiot. <laughs> this is still the goddamn intro of the game. It's more important than that. Usagi. It was about a new enemy. It's been 10 minutes of just intro. Like, holy shit. Some kind of aliens. <laughs> we get abducted and probed weird. <laughs> what 
We're all going to have to work together. Because you don't do that already, apparently. We have to defeat them. That's pretty weird, Chibiusa. Of all things to say pretty weird, that's like extremely normal for these people. But still, the peace must continue uninterrupted. Even if evil aliens invade Earth. I am Sailor Moon. And on behalf of the moon, I'll punish you. Ah, oh, thank God. <laughs> Can we get to this intro screen, please? I just saw what you wrote in the description, IOY. Ah, oh, thank God, okay. Well, welcome to Pretty Soldier Sailor Moon, another story. Uh, so this is an SNES game that was only released in Japan. Um, it never made it to America, and only by the grace of fan translations and stealing video game properties are we able to play it now. Um, I have played half of this before. Um, I just kind of got busy and never really finished the game. I got about, I think, halfway, more than halfway through. Um, so I just thought it'd be kind of fun to play this and share nostalgia with you guys and act all 90s and do silly voices. Um, the gameplay is a lot like Final Fantasy, uh, the typical turn-based RPG type of thing. It's, it's really nothing like Ride Home Route, but it's actually a pretty good little game for Sailor Moon. Um, if you guys have ideas for voices, um, as much as I would like to try to copy at least the American dub, there's only so many voices I can really do of women, so if we want to do something- Oh, you are not starting this bullshit intro- Wait, what? What did- what did I- I talked too long and now something new is happening. Oh no, I'm late for the parade? I wanted to start the game, what is this? Oh, what? Ow! I didn't click anything. This is just a new title screen. Are you okay? Are you okay? <laughs> Sorry, I'm late. I, these voices are gonna be everywhere, by the way. I'm gonna have no consistency. <laughs> What's this? Is this something we'll see later in the game? Cause it's been like a good this is the princess's pendant. So is this in the future? Anshar. An- oh, Anshar. <laughs> Sister. Oh, what's wrong? Nothing. <laughs> this is such invigorating dialogue. Let's go. What is this? Oh, it's like a... Okay. I don't know why they're still using horses in the 30th century, but I, I that sounds nice. From this point on, destiny has been changed. Okay, well that was the thing. Okay, let's quickly start the game where something else weird happens. Um, uh, I am using an Xbox controller, uh, so let's let's do this new game. Your tuxedo mask voice be the male Trevelyan would you like to dance voice from the podcast where you mentioned the glitch and asking souls to dance with you. I can't remember what the voice was though. Oh, Luna. Luna in the show like sounded like an old woman. 
but like this weird lit to it, so I at least have to attempt it. Usagi chan! <laughs> oh, fuck me. Usagi chan, wake up! Um, I feel like I'm just gonna do Sailor Moon because she's talking probably the most in my normal voice just to help me out here. Num num. What's wrong, Luna? There's something peculiar about the town! I don't know what it is exactly. <laughs> fuck this. <laughs> but there's something funny going on. Num num. I don't get this num num translation. Are you sure it isn't your imagination, Luna? No, there's something about the people as well. Mmm, okay. Be careful out there. Good night. W wait a sec. Get up and go check it out. Go and check it out? Uh, no, fuck off. Num num. Look, you soggy chat. Get up! Go check it out? Sure, we'll go check it out. I suppose I'd better go now. Come on, you soggy chan That sounded like weirdly flirtatious. Ah, I just remembered. Remember to take along your diary. You got the diary. Use your diary to save the game. You can save everything you've done so far. But you can only save when you talk to a Luna P-Ball. Okay, yeah. Okay, let's go! Now we're actually playing. <clears throat> Chapter 1. Her Destiny. Luna sounds like a very annoying cat. Honestly, that was how it was in the show. Uh... <laughs> I'm glad you guys are liking this weird cookie monster. I guess we'll save... Uh... Do you wish to save? Yeah. Uh. Oh, okay. So I guess this is items. Uh, uh this is nigiri. Okay, this is gonna be fun. Save. Save where? Uh, this. It's gonna take a while for me to figure out how to play this game because I have not. Can I like interact with things, or is that not a feature yet in video games? Okay. I just read your sign on. <laughs> Katie is slowly going insane. You guys fucking love it. Uh, Sailor Moon was like, before Dragon Age came into my life and ruined everything, Sailor Moon was my obsession. And I loved it so, so very much. So like, uh, when I was in college, uh, I remembered that this game existed and I, and I sought out to go play it and I... Never actually quite finish it just because it's college and you forget things a lot. Um, I can go in here. Oh, it's my brother. What do you want, Usagi? Get out of my room. Fine. So uh, I know like, it's probably going to be very confusing. Appar I I've read that this doesn't make a lot of sense if you haven't watched the show. So I feel like a lot of people are going to be lost watching this. Um, I'll say right now, there's like not that much context that I can give that helps you understand what's going on, because I don't quite know what's going on. But if you have any questions about the show, I would be happy to help answer them. Because that's what I'm here for. When you read the narration, you sound like you just did when the DA4 leaks suggested. <laughs> Why only 99% anti free? <laughs> hey, shit happens, you know? Uh, so, when I was doing the, uh, I found out that this is only, like, a certain aspect ratio. Cannot interact with the TV. This is not like Pokemon where you can interact with the items and be all cutesy. Uh, anyway, but, uh, back in the 90s, uh, well, I, I, I guess backing up even further. Oh, it's my mom. Hold on. Hi, mom. Uh, I guess we sound the same. Oh, you soggy. You're up early today. Oh, thanks. Um... When I was, was doing this theming, I thought I'd make it 90s themed, because that's just kind of fun. And back in the 90s, I feel like in Sailor Moon web pages, there was this weird thing that you were supposed to be proud that you didn't have hentai on your page. So I just had to add that in there. Like, I remember there were so many, like, buttons. Like, I, I, I specifically went out to, like, old 90s uh, Sailor Moon websites that I remember visiting to. What is this thing that's floating? Um... And I found like graphics to use in the sidebar, and it was it was kind of fun revisiting old things and 
Yeah, I actually found a couple of buttons that said like, you know, no hentai on this page, but they were like extremely huge and wouldn't fit right, but. All right, let's, let's just go off and explore what's going on. Uh... Hmm... I seem to have lost my way. Oh, you look pretty tired. This medicine should recover your health. There's always lots of tired people. I, you know, that's a mood. Now where's the exit? Same, honestly. Uh, it's a license-based 90s video game. You can't expect to interact with shit. This is this is fair. Will this later be uploaded to your MySpace? Uh, yes, actually. My MySpace is gonna have all of this playthrough. How would you like to meet my son? He's very handsome. That is a very fat lady. Um, she's actually someone you can see in the show. She's not like a named character. She's just like always in the background when you need an angry fat lady. Uh... And <laughs> on my good Christian Minecraft server. God, it, I feel like Minecraft, like Christian Minecraft servers really fits into this like um, narrative I'm trying to build, but it's like way at a, like in the wrong date. If you want to learn more about how to play this game, then you should go to the clock shop at the game center. Well, that's breaking the fourth wall a little. The clock shop at the game center. I just got run over. Okay. Um, did I miss stairs over here? Do you think there's more Sailor Moon porn or Dragon Age porn? Sailor Moon porn, hands down, just because it's been out longer. Um, that and, like, I know there's this weird obsession with, um, Sailor Moon. Like, I, I don't know, I've seen shit that scarred me as, for life as a kid. Oh. Usagi! Let's investigate the rest of the neighborhood first! I'm apparently pissed about that. Can I get a Coke? I cannot get a Coke. But that is clearly Coca-Cola, by the way. Uh, did you say something? A little while ago, I saw some weird guy go into the OCP store. Okay, so we're probably gonna have to go to the OCP. Oh, that's the Crown Game Center. Oh, you're from the show. D don't talk to me while I'm trying to concentrate. I'll stop talking mid-sentence. Uh. Okay, wait, wait, hold on. I actually want to explore that. Uh... Also, I love how this, this thing just says, EXCITING! What are you... In this game, accessories change your attack and defense power. They're sold at various shops. Okay. Uh... Hey, Usagi! You, or... This is a character. You look no. I don't know. I don't. I don't know what voice to give him. Someone said Swedish chef, but I cannot do that. Uh. Maybe just like surfer dude. You're looking as healthy as ever today, man. Just look on your face as you're healthy. I'm super healthy. Okay, that's. Who are you? This game is really long, so you should save your game whenever you see a Luna Pee Ball. Well, go ahead. I'll pass. Uh. But there are two big pools of porn drawers in DBZ. Horny dudes and horny gay dudes. I mean, yeah. You can walk faster by holding on the B button. Oh. If you press L and R while walking, you can dash. Oh. Oh, shit! Oh, fuck! Oh my god, I just, like, fucking fly! Okay, thank you, random man. Okay, we're gonna fucking fly through this town! Holy shit, look at this! Oh, books. Closed. Okay. I don't know why Usagi would go see books, honestly. What's this? What are you? Elegant shop. Oda Fuku. Yeah, oh, it's closed. Uh. Man, I'm loving this dash. Okay. Ooh. Uh, do you say things? You don't. I don't know why I expected. It's you? That black cat is following you. That's very bad luck. Uh, I wish these peaceful days could go on forever. That's an ominous. Clocks! Oh, that's the... 
how to play the game. Okay, old man, what do you say? Welcome. A uh, buy? A watch? Wake up. Oh, speed up. Keep speed up. Keep track of time. I feel like I shouldn't buy anything. Can I sell something? Oh. Life water. Okay, I'm gonna exit. But little girl says certain kinds of medicines only work on specific status ailments, so it's a good idea to have a lot of different ones. Cool. Got so hard to talk to people. You can cure items in a fight. Uh, they'll help to restore your health. Uh, many items can be used both in fights and while walking in town. But certain items can only be used in battle or the field. So be careful. Okay. This is very... It's very important that you learn link techniques. To discover new link techniques, simply press the start button while in the field. You'll see the makeup links menu on the screen along with all the senshi. You can discover and examine the link techniques with the X button. Okay. You will automatically see the name of the technique if the link succeeds. Also, all link techniques you discover what is going on are written down in your diary. But be careful, some senshi can't be linked at any level. And if the elements don't match, the resulting attack will be very weak. Also, a senshi's link attack's power lap won't... In the, their laps won't increase if the links aren't used. The link technique can occur between up to three senshi. Okay, well, that's something to look forward to. Oh, okay. What are... Escape. Choose this icon to try and run away. If you think the fight will be way too difficult or your heart is pounding in fear, then run away. Okay. Defend. This icon will allow you to defend. While defending, all damage is sustained is cut in half. Okay. Item. Use this icon to select items in battle. It's wise to you time your use of these carefully. Formation techniques. This icon is for using formation techniques. Different attacks can be used in each of the four formations. Okay. Uh, link techniques. You can use this icon to select link techniques. These techniques are used to make combination attacks between senshi. There are numerous combinations possible. Special techniques. Use this icon to select special technique. You can check these in the techniques menu screen. Attack. This icon is used to do a physical attack. The strength of an attack is determined by your level and accessories. So be sure to put on accessory. I'm so glad accessorizing is a fucking mechanic. Icons of the wall are the commands available in battle. You stand in front of each one and press the A button. A short description of the command will then appear. Oh, fuck. I did all this already. Oh, hi, hi Jordan. <laughs> oh, God. Uh, yeah, I don't think I actually told Jordan I was streaming this today. Uh, this is, uh, this is something, let me tell you. 24 hour AM. Oh, can I buy stuff from here? Uh, feels good to get up early. That is a bold face lie, little girl. It's a very good place to look for advice. The game center. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Good morning. Is it really morning? My kids like to get up early. That's all weird. What do you sell? Oh, a lot of food? Okay. Is this gonna be like a hub? This is what the people want. Forget Anthem and Sailor Moon time. Honestly, oh, Melvin. Hey, it's Naruchan with you. Oh, is Naruchan with you? Okay. I heard some loud noises coming from inside the Osa P store. What do you think they could be? I think that's where we have to go. Um, but I want to fuck around with literally everything else in this town before we uh, skate on over there. Uh, oh, hello. Have you ever seen the Sailor Senshi in action? They're so cool. They are. They are very cool. Uh, nothing here. Oh, she's going to get mad at me. Did I miss the Osa P store? Uh... Oh, policeman. If you go east from here, you'll reach the Hiwaka Shrine. And west of here is the Juban Hospital. Cool. Uh, over here... Yeah, she's gonna get mad at me. Uh... Getting run over by cars. Okay, really, though, where's this Osa P store that everyone wants me to go to? Alright, what, what is this? It's a school holiday today. Can I go in? You'll need a key to open the store. Okay. Did I miss the Osa P store somehow? I really... I thought... 
I probably just missed it. Is there like a map? Uh, makeup links. Uh, I don't really think I should be doing this now. Uh, okay, let's get out of this. What about the, uh, other button? Oh. Cursor type. Uh, text speed. Oh, let's, uh, bump that shit up to 11. Oh. So it's faster. Ooh! Background color. Ooh! I'm gonna do pink. Text color. It's so weird that it lets you choose the text color. I kind of like the purple. We're gonna go purple. Okay. Now that we've accessorized the game, now we can maybe find out where I'm going. Why well, do you put the text on one? So it'll be super fast. Because I like speed reading in my games. Okay, where is OCP? I thought I've gone into that's the game center. None of these are OCP. Okay, am I crazy? <clears throat> Man, the game just began. I'm already lost. Books. Okay, that's that's the elegant shop. Yeah, that's not it. Okay, so then. Oh, there it is. I just missed this row somehow. Oh, it's right next to the clocks. I'm just an idiot. Okay, let's go. Uh. Oh, okay. So in the uh, American dub, this character had like a country voice. So like, I have to do that. Kiao, somebody help! <laughs> Ah, it's Naruchan or Molly. It's Molly. Molly's being attacked by that monster. I'm just gonna Usagi-chan transform into Sailor Moon. Moon cosmic power makeup. That was kind of underwhelming. That was like the best part of the show. Oh, they're right there. Who's there? For love and justice, I am the sailor-suited pretty soldier, Sailor Moon. Listen up, you monster. Who attacks helpless girls? I, Sailor Moon, in the name of the moon, will punish you. And she, like, looks at the fucking camera. <laughs> what impudence. Oh, hey, it had a little voice in it. Oh, we're doing battles. Okay, Persian cut? Uh... Okay, so there technically when I was getting this ROM, there was a, uh, like, extra DLC to get, like, a better translation for the monsters, but I thought it would be kind of funny to have the bad translation. I don't know what Persian Cut is. Okay, what do I do? Okay, A. Um, special attacks? Throw Tiara at single enemy. Oh, okay. I guess we'll do that. Rude. Oh, you can hear her, like, the little attacks. I forgot, but... Oh, shit, she didn't die. Uh. Do that again? Okay. Uh. Uh. I'm gonna punch it? Hey! I got three experience and a puzzle piece. A demon's come back to life. So this is what you were talking about, Luna. Thank you, Sailor Moon. It's all right now. You're if you're ever in danger again, just call me. That was very clever, Sailor Moon. I'm glad I can rely on you. Does her mom say anything? Thank you, Sailor Moon, for the bottom of my heart. <clears throat> so now... What do I do? This battle music, though! <laughs> this is... It, it, the, the music so far has been inspired by, like, what was in the series, so... The new theme for Split the Veil. Oh, God. Maybe. Jordan, can we uh, change all... Can, can we just become a Sailor Moon podcast? Is, can we do that now? 
Why does mom sound posh? Because it's kind of what it was in the show, though. Like, for some reason, she had an accent, but her mom didn't. It was really weird. Oh, she got a cute little room. Oh, chest? Lucky, you found ancient doll. That sounds extremely haunted. <laughs> uh... Hello, I'm arriving fashionably late as usual. You've missed everything, Claire. The stream's over now. Again, no, I'm kidding. Uh, yeah, I guess I'll save because I actually did something. Uh, oh, I had to like go down all the way to the bottom to save. Oh, this is a lot of button presses. Let's see. Shit, I didn't mean to go in here. Kind of fidgety controls, to be honest. Not to diss, but USS, USA anime dubs kind of suck. Oh, no, they definitely did. The, the American anime uh, dub is honestly the worst. Um, but, like, I just have fun memories of it because I was a kid. Uh, but, like, yeah, God, some of the... So Sailor Moon had two or three different voices. I can't remember the exact number now. And, like, the, the first season was a really good voice. And everything after that was just weird. Like, especially, uh... Like, she kind of started, like, I, I know I was doing a weird voice for Luna, but, like, in some later versions, like, some later, uh, seasons, it kind of sounded like that. Yawn. I think I'll go back home and take a nap. Okay. Oh, now we're in Tuxedo Mask's, uh, room. That was his golden crystal. Ooh. Darian. Where am I? Master. That voice I just heard now was... You, you're Kunzai. Okay, so this might be confusing to people who only watched the first season. In the first season of Sailor Moon, these four generals were the bad guys. But in the uh, Lord of Sailor Moon to geek out on you guys, they were technically like the male equivalent of the Sailor scouts for tuxedo mask but they were turned evil but at the end of that season at least in the comics so i guess this is going with comic era they turned good again but they were technically dead and their spirits are trapped in gems so he still has the gems and so now this is a dream of the spirit that's trapped in the gem thanks for listening to my deep lore uh your kunzite uh he he kind of had a like a very generic evil voice. So I'm just gonna, I guess, just be generic evil. Master, destiny draws near. An evil comes, an evil comet is approaching from an evil star to return destiny to its origins. A horrible comet with the power to return everything. That doesn't quite make sense. Now, in the future, and in the past, it is giving birth to an existence in which. All shall be returned to what has been. What? Returning destiny? When will this happen? This is from the distant future. Do I have something to do with it now? You shall choose which future. Uh... <laughs> he just... Wait! Kunzite? The audience is confused in a horror video. <laughs> Maybe that's my my thing. Oh god. <laughs> oh boy, he sounds like Keanu Reeves. He kind of looks like Keanu Reeves, though. Was that a dream? But I get to choose which future. The Shin and oh, those are that the shit the shit the the shit nuos or whatever. That's the names of uh, the the general people who are stuck in gems is glittering. Hey everyone, listen up. I don't know who's talking. Oh. Hey everybody, transform! Monsters have appeared again. I wonder what in the world has happened. Oh gosh. Okay, Taylor Jupiter had a really... God, I, sh I need more water before I started this. Have the death have the Deathbusters been revived? Okay, so this is in between the seasons. No one really cares. Um, <laughs> Katie 
she's like an on or off switch. She's either as deep in lore or she doesn't care. Honestly, kind of. Um... Let's see, Shio Jupiter used to have like this really raspy voice, but I don't think I could do that without destroying myself. Um, maybe like, I don't want to just go with a man, but like, maybe something down here? I don't know. Maybe I can try the rat. Have no. I'm gonna just go with raspy. She's gonna like, kind of sound like Yoda or something. Have the Deathbusters been revived? No, that's terrible. <laughs> Oh god, I'm gonna run out of voices so quick. I can only do like six voices. Oh Jesus. Uh I I'm completely stumped on what to, I'm just gonna okay. Have the Deathbusters been revived? That's just gonna be fucking Jupiter. <laughs> Usagi, are you sure you didn't dream that? Oh you're so mean, Ray Chan. Amy Chan believes me, right? Huh? Where's Amy Chan? Kate Mulgrew voice! <laughs> yeah, she, okay, imagine the like Jupiter sounds like Kate Mulgrew. Uh, okay, Amy was really, like, soft-spoken, so... Sorry, I came as fast as I could. I just talked with... Er, Melvin. Anyway, let's go inside. She sounds like Ash! <laughs> hmm. It's been a long time since you've met with Melvin, huh? Is that Urwa Khan? I can't remember. Who is, who is Urwa Khan? He came to Tokyo for his holiday. Okay, I have no idea who that guy is. Never mind. So if you decide to go with Urwa Khan, who is this man? Um, well, there's some national exams coming up, so you see... See what? I thought we'd go to the library. Drip. Eh? You want to go to the library with him? Oh, really? Yimichan, you can just tell me if you want. <laughs> that sounded so... <laughs> terrible. Ah, you're sneaky, Mako-chan. Uh, I need a better voice for Rei. She was, like, really whiny and bitchy. So, what are the date plans you guys have after that? Huh? It, it's not like that. We can't date. We're still junior high! But one day we'll be right we'll be right for Urwakun. Yes. Yeah. So where are you going? Hi! Sorry for making y'all wait! What's wrong, Amy Chan? Your face is all red! Hey, Amy Chan's got a boyfriend! And he's coming here soon! W wait a second, Mako Chan! It's not like that with Urwakun! Oh god, okay, so I don't remember what his Japanese name, but this is- his name was literally Chad. Uh, oh god. <laughs> um, good lord. So he needs like a Chad name. Or Chad voice. Uh, hey everyone, how are ya? That's, that's, that is just Jupiter's voice. Ray said, no. Ray said you look better than ever today. The- Thank you. Oh, I'm not even going to try that name. Thank you, Chad. Take it easy, everyone. And they just Okay, great cameo. So, Ray-chan. What was that, Yusagi? Why are you talking with that tone of voice? Because of what just happened. You and Chad are great friends, right? It's... It's nothing. Really? 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 It's nothing! Well then, Usagi, who's your boyfriend? Huh? Me? It seems Mamo-chan and I are the perfect couple. We'll be like this forever. He's kissed me already! <laughs> it's so innocent! I shouldn't have said that. <laughs> Give these girls like 10 years and they're going to be talking about who they fucked that weekend. <laughs> oh, God. Thanks for that. 
Sai. Are you... <laughs> Even when you act like that, I'm still sure that I can't keep fucking up with this. True. Usagi chants with Mamoru san <laughs> Amy chan and Uruka might be a bit separated, but they're a couple. And it doesn't matter what Ray chan says, she's with Chad san <laughs> Sai. I want a boyfriend too. Me too. Sai. Don't you have to go already, Amy chan Oh, yeah. Sorry about today, everyone. And she's off. Hey, do you want to follow her? <laughs> Fucking hell. Huh? That's really me. Thank you, Jupiter. But I really want to know. W wait a second, everyone. Okay, let's go. Yay. <laughs> huh? Mako-chan, aren't you coming? Uh... No, I stand firm on this. Th thank you. <laughs> Jupiter, stand firm on your beliefs. I'm really worried about- Why are you worried about her? She's going on a fucking date to the library. <laughs> What's gonna happen? Oh, okay, just this once. Ah, oh, fucking Jupiter. Can you imagine being the serious Japanese businessman who had to write this dialogue? <laughs> Honestly, yeah. <laughs> Blocked and reported. Oh god. It's been so long since I met Uraqua. Ur Ur Urawa? Urawa? So we just missed the fucking bus. Are we just gonna run? Amy Chan got on the. Amy Chan got on that bus, right? That bus goes to Tokyo Station, doesn't it? Let's go on the bus, too! I'm so excited! Katie librarians are perfect! Urawa? I don't know. Am I me again? Okay, I'm me again. Let's, let's fucking zoom! Okay, we can't... There's just trees in this road. There's really only... Oh, hello. This is Tokyo Station. Okay. Oh, what? Oh, uh, I will have a hard pass on that. Alright. Yeah, this game is uh, older than some of you in chat, I know. Ah! Amy Chan's right there! Usagi Chan, hide! This is really weird, following our friend on a date. <clears throat> Can we have fossil corn do one of these voices in one of the girl voices? Yeah, no, totally! There should be, uh... There should be episodes where you guys come in here and, like, guest, uh... Like, do some guest voices, because I'm getting already really tired of doing all these voices. Uh... What do you say? I wonder how far those two have gotten! Fucking Venus! Fucking Venus! Mino, Mina, whatever your name is, they... Uh, are you fucking kidding me? Even if she acts like that, those two are really close. They've been sending letters and shit. I wonder how, uh, Urwawakan is. Oh, what? It's been such a long time. I hope Urwa is alright. I, I wish I remembered this guy's English name, just to, like, <laughs> for my own sanity. Looks like the bullet trains arrived. Those two must be having a wonderful reunion. Yeah, they're- <laughs> she probably thinks they're, like, fucking- <laughs> fucking in the train. This, that would be so fun and so dangerous considering what we get up to in the channel. <laughs> yeah, honestly, yeah. Yeah, hmm. Doesn't something seem funny? Uh. Wait a second, what's happened? Th there's a monster in there. Get out of the way, you fucking bitch. <laughs> monster? The monster trapped a boy in there. Get the police. I 
That's a reasonable response. Everyone, let's go check it out. Right, during this uh, emergency, I'm going to quickly run here and make sure I didn't like miss any items because this is, I'm a hoarder. Uh, platform five. Is there actual combat in this game or is it all story? There, there eventually it'll open, the game will open up a bit and there will be a lot more combat. So I think this is maybe a story day. Amy-chan. Everyone, you've stalked me, you creepy motherfuckers. You've come to my help. Huh? I can feel so many different auras. When did Sailor Moon get feel auras? <laughs> Everyone transform! Mercury star power. Mars star power. Jupiter star power. Venus star power. Moon cosmic power. Let's go. All right, now we're getting into some actual combat here. Uh, but not enough, apparently. Uh, save, because I just don't want to relive all of this stuff. Oh, okay, so these are all my people in my party. Can I? Oh, do I not like heal up in between? Uh, do I have any accessories at all? I have nothing. Okay. Should I heal up? I'm gonna not heal up and see what happens. Um, what is down here? Oh, this is. Oh, this is for later. I gotta go save Amy's boyfriend. Can someone like look up what Amy's boyfriend's English name is? Um, this is this is a thing in the anime, and uh, it's the episode of like the like. Uh, I think he fucking turns into like a lion. Am I remembering the right episode? And it's in the Doom Tree series. I can tell you that much. I can I can see his face. I think. Maybe I'm wrong. It's been quite a while since I've gone balls deep into Sailor Moon stuff. <clears throat> Let's see. Combat. <laughs> This guy's a fucking unit. Who is this man? This is not, this is just some random ass sprite. This has nothing to do with Sailor Moon. Greg, it is Greg. Thank you, Chris. It's fucking Greg. Okay, we're now calling him Greg from now on. Uh, whose turn is it? Oh, it's Jupiter's. Okay, yeah, I guess we, oh wait. I don't think I, can I go back? Oh, I can go back, okay. Uh. Three and four. Some thunder. Uh, we're just gonna do all special attacks because that sounds fun. Uh, should, why does she have three little gems but everyone else has two? Attack with bubbles, that sounds painful. Um, crescent beam, sure. Aw, that is so cute. Um, I don't mind links, but I don't think YouTube likes links, so I, I, I wouldn't, <clears throat> but. Is that a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle? I think so. Um, okay, this guy still isn't dead. I'm a little depressed. She didn't have any more gem things, so we're just gonna attack. She has one. She has, oh, she didn't have a... God, what is with Mercury's attacks here? Okay, we're just gonna fucking punch him, I guess. Oh man, she did a backflip. <clears throat> what Sailor Moon beat up Leonardo? Uh, hey, Jupiter leveled up. Mars leveled up, Moon leveled up, Mercury leveled up, Venus leveled up. Oh, cool, cool. You dig that. Uh... Now what, um, it's like Lynx, right? Uh, maybe with Moon? Oh, wait, hold on, how do I control this? I'm just gonna link everybody. Wait, hold on. Uh, and then, can I only do three? How do I? Okay, well, hold on. That makes sense to me. How do I confirm? 
What am I doing? Okay, register with the Y button. Finish with the start. Register. Finish the start. Okay, great. We'll do that. Um, then what are these puzzle pieces? Options? No. Do I not... Do I not know what these puzzle pieces do? Okay. Oh, I can- Oh, thank God, I can tell her blood type. Ah, uh, her hobby is chess reading. Her birthday is September 10th. This is very interesting, but I got shit to do. Okay, let's get out of here. I don't know what's going on with this menu. Alright, let's keep going. Woo! Oh, there we go. Is he lap short for lap dance? Hey, maybe. Okay, now this is the other ninja turtle. Oh my god, look how many gems I have now. Golly. Okay, um... Isn't there, like, link attack? I can't do one. Oh, because she's not in a linked thing. Um... And there's formation. Oh! Create a bullet? Yeah, sure. Don't know what that does. Um... Just go all out here. Yeah, I don't really know what's going on. Uh, tech it all. Ooh, wink sword. That sounds fun. Oh, it's so cute how they have like the little like uh, anime clips in here. I didn't get to see the bullet, though. I want to see the bullet. Jupiter leveled up. Mars, Moon, Mercury, and Venus. Man, we leveled up really easy here. Woo. Oh, story. Uh, Greg. <laughs> Fucking Greg. Why does enemy look like a blue Dr. Robotnik? Uh, I'm sorry, it's a Ninja Turtle. Um... <laughs> Are you all right, Greg? M mizuno san Greg, hang in there. Just hang on. Oh my god, he's bleeding. It's okay, he's only unconscious. A monster. Surely Queen Beryl has been revived. Anyway, let's get back to the Haikawa Shrine. <clears throat> Greg, are you all right? Yeah. No. He he was kind of wimpy, so... Kind of like, yeah, yeah, no, it's, hmm. Yeah, I'm alright now. Well, Mizuno-san, I had a vision in my dream. The past and the future changed places. What? I don't understand it very well, but history... No. Destiny will change. Destiny? So the future has been replaced? No, that's not what I fucking said. They switched places. The past has also been replaced. The past? This makes no goddamn sense. <laughs> ah! Katsu! <laughs> that's... Who is it, an enemy? My name is Sin! <laughs> This is merely a greeting! <laughs> oh, cough, cough. I'm all covered in soot! What was that? <laughs> I don't know. Uh, cough, cough. Oh, um, <laughs> Hey, Ray-chan, your face is pitch black! Why does this weirdly fit into our theme of accidental, uh, blackface? God dang. Oh, shut up! Cough, cough. Ray-chan, are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. My clothes are all dirty. I wanna go take a bath. <clears throat> My face again! I know! Sin! Hmm, that's what it said! <laughs> Who is it? A new enemy? Ray, telephone, it's Haruka. Oh, hey, that's Sailor Uranus. Ah, I'll take the call for Uh, oh. Shouldn't you get the phone? Sally Chan, answer the phone quickly. 
I mean, I would, but I don't know where the phone is. Uh... You guys can't seem to get away from it no matter what game you're playing. I know. It always seems to be my fault. Oh, hey, let's save. That seems like... Do you wish to save? Yeah. Yeah, boy, yeah. Uh... Save. Her destiny. I can't get over some of these names. Uh, let's uh, explore the house a bit while we not dot, uh, do anything with the phone. Destiny changing. I wonder what in the world is beginning to happen. He's dead. Um, Busagi chat, are you going to do about the phone? <clears throat> Uranus now? Yeah, Haruka is, Haruka is Uranus. Um, that's just where I came from, isn't it? Yep, I'm stupid. Okay. All right. All right, Grandpa. Oh, so you're going to date the girl who's Usagi? Oh, well, I asked for someone, so I guess. Oh, that, that ruined my throat. <laughs> I hope he doesn't ever come back. Hello, Haruka-san? Oh. No, she had, like, a cool voice. Like, oh, no. Ah, oh, Dunga. No. Something terrible has happened. Hotaru's fallen ill. Huh? What happened? She's sick? No, this is... The doctors don't know either, but this could be... If you don't come here, I can't tell you. If you don't come here, I can't tell you. <laughs> what? So come to the Juban Hospital right away. What's wrong? Something's happened to Hucharo-chan. Huh? Hotaro-chan? Oh, that's not her voice. I just have to go to the Juban Hospital for a while. Alright, let's go. <laughs> I'm glad you all liked my old man voice. All right, let's go uh, see my uh, my favorite Sailor Scout, the uh, Saturn. So many nasty things have been happening lately. Usaki chat, I have to check out a few things. Okay, fuck off then. If something happens, contact me. How? You're a cat. Do you have a phone? Wait, can I bring the others with me? What did they say? That's just what she said earlier. Your old man voice sounds like a pervert. Honestly, that was kind of his characteristic in the the game, or the anime. None of this seems right at all. I have a bad feeling about all this. Great. Okay, so this is worthless. You can just cat call her. Oh, Susaga, that was awful. That was the worst. Oh, God. Okay, let's, uh... Go find the hospital. I have a question for you. Why is it so fast, like Tamar fast? I don't really know, to be honest. What great weather we're having today. It is really fast, though, when you, when you do this. Uh, oh, this is a, a crow. Uh, what does Grandpa say? Jed works well around here. Great. I can't... Oh, I can't do it. See... Something just happened? Okay, what do I do? Where do I go from here? Uh, okay, we want to go to the hospital. I think this was the school? Or is this the hospital? Oh, that's Molly. Have you seen Melvin? I forgot where we meant to meet. Okay, this is, well, we'll... Can I go through all these doors? Oh my god, these are so many doors. This is this is not. We're gonna come back here. So I'm gonna come back here when we actually want to be here. Um. After all these voices, I'm not sure Kay's gonna be able to stream tomorrow. Honestly, that is a valid question. Um. Where is this? What is this? Oh, that's a hospital. Okay, let's look at the parking lot. See if there's any chests because we found one secretly. Uh, I cannot go past these bushes. These are weird parking lots. Uh, okay, nurse, what's up? Tobo Hotaru san's hospital room is on the third floor. It's the one on the far left. Thank you. Uh, I feel like I don't need to save, but I also don't want to walk here again. Yeah, sure. To be fair, for her walking so fast, I am, like, dashing or whatever. 
So like it's her normal walk speed something more like this. That's like a more reasonable, but I just want to be speedy fast. Okay, she said on the far left, so we're gonna go right and see what we can find. Uh, are these all gonna be really boring? Like one of these has to have some like prize in it, right? Oh man. Yes, Jordan. I'm going to listen to this at the gym with a Bluetooth speaker. Hey, you can fuck right off with that. That would be the worst. Uh, you know we're not. <laughs> yeah, that would uh, Jordan. That is honestly like the worst thing you could do. That would be. Uh, I mean, at the very least, it's all going to be people I know or I don't know. So that's one thing. You will probably get a lot of good looks. Uh, man, we are just so many rooms. One of the, like, come on, game makers. Is this just the same room over and over again? Give me, give me a bone. Give me, like, one chest. Make this all worthwhile for me. <clears throat> okay, this is, like, at least the last floor. Okay, well, we have a save point, so that's not ominous. Uh, I'm gonna have nothing. This was all for naught, and I feel cheated. I wish I had the guts. Oh, God, I'm glad you don't. Uh, is there another room? No, it's the last room. Okay, let's get in here and actually continue on with this story. We've been waiting for you, Odango. Okay, so this is like in referencing to her hair shape. So it's like calling her Meatball Head. Uh, we've been waiting for you, Meatball Head. Are you awake, Hotaro chan Meatball Head's come to see you. Huh? Why has Hotaro chan grown into a child? Hotaro chan are you okay? Cough, cough. It only stopped hurting a while ago. I'm fine since you got here. What could have happened? Oh, God. She had, like, a really... I don't know. Oh, uh, for those of you who don't know the show, the girl with the green hair and the girl with the short hair uh, are lovers. Fun fact. So this is your, your daily dose of lesbianism. Um... What would be hilarious if we found out everyone in the gym loves Sailor Moon? Oh, God, no. God, okay, what what's Neptune's voice? Can I get a hand? Can I have like a theme for Neptune's voice? Um God, I She sounded I don't know, just like a generic woman in the show, honestly. Uh Hold on. Okay, I my throat's dying, so I'm going to get water and let you guys like think about what you want. Elegant upper class lady. Um. Elegant upper. She's Neptune. Just gargle as you talk. Oh god, okay. Elegant upper class lady. I don't know if I could do a good elegant upper class lady. Um, who's elegant upper. Like, British? Kind of? That's elegant upper class, but I can't really do British accent. Um. God, my mind is blanking. British would be good. Okay, I'm gonna try. Oh god, my British is so bad. Oh god, it's gonna sound cockney. I'm afraid. I'm generally afraid. So the warden voice. I can't remember. You guys say like voices I've done in the past, but it's not like those are like characters in my mind. I don't remember what the warden voice is. Okay. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna attempt a British, and everyone's gonna make fun of me. And this is just how it's gonna be. Uh, I got. I I have. My mind is actually blanking out. 
on what a British person sounds like. This is Stage Fright 101, guys. Do Luna's voice, but softer. Okay, we're gonna try that. She just started stumbling. Okay, that's that's pretty good. We're gonna go there. <laughs> she transformed right back. She transformed back right in front of our eyes. Yeah, but it was so painful. <laughs> and the oh god, Mugen Gaku. I have no fucking idea what that is. Has been revived recently too. I think something evil has begun happening. Yeah, Hotaro, have you ever felt that kind of pain before? It was like I was under the influence of a Tauri Hung Crystal. Okay, this is in reference to the third season of Sailor Moon that I'm not even going to bother explaining. Essentially, she had another crystal that was evil that was given to her by bad guys, so it was like when she was possessed. Usagi Chan's silver crystal seemed to help relieve the pain. The Tauri Hung Crystal? The... Then Hotaro-chan, are you going to turn back into Mistress Nine? I think it's okay now. Yeah, Hotaro has opened her eyes and is a Sailor Senshi now. She won't turn into an enemy. When I collapsed, I felt that I was enveloped by darkness. <laughs> but that evil power, that evil power is an enormous power of darkness. I felt like my destiny was being influenced by something else. A strong new power. <laughs> you made Hutaru sound insane. Honestly, kind of. <laughs> oh, God. Excuse me, but it's time for a checkup. Wait a minute. This room should be marked no entry. Who or what are you? Hee hee hee. I'm gonna get you troublesome, Sailor Senshi. Bleh. Die. <laughs> okay, then. Wait, is Hutaru gonna fight? Ah, oh, damn. Palmacon. <laughs> From the makers of Past Eats, it's Palmacon! For all your sexy nurse needs. Okay, we're gonna... Can I... Oh, I can't do any of this. Dang. Um, no. We're just gonna do all this. I don't know why you would want to not waste all your crystals at the beginning of the game. <laughs> Balmacon sounds like a Pokemon day. It kind of does. Five? That fucking sucked. Uh, she can't do anything but punch, so I guess we're gonna go punch. You can do that at least. Uh, you can't do shit, so we're just gonna punch. Crunchy. Three. One? Man, Neptune fucking sucks. Jesus. Uh, I think I can't do anything interesting. So, punch. Punch. Uh, she is not... Uh, Uranus is kind of taking a beating. Oh, okay, good. Uh, da, da, da. <laughs> Didn't we once beat that enemy before? This is the second time a demon has attacked today. Why are enemies that we've already beaten being revived? I wonder what this could be. If its destiny was changed the same way as mine, I think it might be possible. The power to change destiny? That's fucking stupid! Who wrote this bullshit? I wonder who the heck these enemies are. Apsu Sama. Oh my god. We have completed the first stage of our strategy. In a few places, previously beaten enemies have been revived and attacked some people. The destiny of the Juban district in the 20th century has been changed. Uh, god. What is this woman? I have put you through much. Take this as a present. <laughs> With this rave, you should become more powerful than the Sailor Senshi. <laughs> you may step down. Thank you very much, Apsusawa.
should they go oh, god even more voices of women i don't know how to handle this um they're all just gonna be rough i think yeah with this we can become stronger than the legendary sailor senshi oh, our destiny shall certainly be changed that's what i thought too <laughs> are you people satisfied already i'm still anxious i'm with marduk and Sharsama? It's too early to be satisfied. The Sailor Senshi are still not dead. To turn destiny into what we truly desire, we must retrieve the silver crystal from those who possess it. We shall only have a chance if we get the silver crystal. That's true. The power of the silver crystal is too strong to ignore. So we have crossed over time, protected by the silver crystal, and arrived in this time. This is our only chance! Our power has become strong too! She suddenly became an old man! <laughs> oh god. As soon as no interest in Sailor Moon, I'm way more into this than I should be. Good. At the moment, the Sailor Senshi are separated into two different groups. Okay, now is our chance. We can get these girls. Whoosh. No one fucking cares. <laughs> do not act easy towards the princess if you do indeed want to change destiny. Ah, fuck. Oh boy. Anyway, let's check out the town a little bit. Alright. Perhaps we can find a clue left behind by the enemy. Yeah, alright. I can feel that something's about to happen. Let's go back to my house to make sure that everyone is safe. Okay, let's go. Wait, I'm going too! You have to rest. I'm a Sailor Senshi too. I can't just rest while everyone fights. I don't want Destiny to be changed any more than it already has. Can't we take Hocharo Chan along too? Ugh. Alright. Okay, you can come with us. Take care, alright? Thanks, everyone. Alright. Can you please drink a cup or two of hot tea with honey with your poor throat after this stream is over? Yeah, I'm gonna need it. God. I can't wait till tomorrow's stream where I sound like a, like a frog and everyone's just <laughs> saying like, oh, what did you do to yourself? Um, we explored the Juban Hospital pretty- Oh. Okay, we're just gonna have fights now, I guess. Oh, those are- uh, Oh, I need to heal Uranus up. Tensi? Tesni? And Garobin. I rec so these are actually um, monsters from the show. Garovin is from the episode when Sailor Mercury came to be her true form or whatever. And then the tennis one was also from the first season. Um, what can Saturn do? She does nice. Uh, I guess like attacks that, attacks with the heart single, single, single. So only one person. Moving the one in the back. Multiple. We want to do multiple ones. Oh, she's gonna fucking die. Yeah, she's dead. Okay. Tighten your diaphragm, Katie. It helps with the voice. Okay, I'll try. Uh, okay. Um. I guess just. She only has one power? Seriously? Uh, she's done. Get her down first. And then I think she only has single attacks. So I guess we'll just work on her. Man, everyone hates Utara! Stop attacking her! Jesus! One. Fucking one. Okay, we killed one at least. Okay, we need like... Items. Legendary Chalice for Sailor Moon. Cure 30 HP. Rice. Is there 300? Wow. Well, I guess the Nigiri. Um. I mean, she can't do anything other than just hit people. This one seems to do alright. Um. She could also do that. We're gonna try to focus on her. Oh, miss. Thank God. 
Oh, great. She died. She went about the item I wanted to use. That's fucked. Man, Neptune is absolutely fucking worthless. She is just absolutely worthless. I think I'm going to die here, guys. I... This, this had a difficulty curve. Um... Uh, okay, I'm trying to save Neptune, so we'll... I can't, like, revive anybody if they're dead. That's the thing I cannot do. Oh, life water. Resurrect in battle. Oh, there we go. That's what I need. We'll do Uranus. Oh, come on. Okay, so that's what I need to do. We need to do these life waters. Okay. Um, Neptune's kind of worthless, so we'll do Saturn. She can actually, like, do stuff, so we're going to... Wait, hold on. There was one for the multiple. Okay, we killed one. Just turn it up, guys. Uh, Saturn can't do anything. We're just gonna have her... Actually, make her do the life water. Because the other characters are far more um, important and they can actually do stuff. Attack this guy. I guess we're just gonna punch this guy. Three. Good lord. This might be a game where I have to really sit there and grind people. When the Sailor Moon Anthem DLC finally comes out, we're gonna be in prime position to capitalize on that niche market. Hey, look, this is. Everything I love in a channel now. We have Dragon Age, we have Sailor Moon. I could not ask for more. Um, I guess we're just gonna punch this thing to death. Hey, we killed it. Oh, that's nice. If you told uh, the character to attack and the monster dies, it just goes to the next available monster. We did it, everybody! We got orange juice and a puzzle piece. Neptune, level up! Good, because I needed it. Um, let's see. Uh, I believe Katie said that at NES it was only released in Japan, though, so we have to have the same fan base to thank for this version of the stream. Essentially, yeah. Um, it's, it's for the Super Nintendo, though. I don't really know much about Super Nintendo, so I don't know if that makes a huge difference. I'm gonna quickly go back into this hospital and save, because that was a rough encounter. Uh, save. Okay, now there was more stuff. What is. The, oh, fuck. What is this puzzle? Because I keep getting puzzle pieces. Oh my god, this is actually just gonna be like a little puzzle that's gonna be revealed as the game goes on. Oh, that is great. Link text? Okay, that's the thing I'm gonna have to read on. Techniques, Sailor Moon? Oh, that's just looking at the things. Can I, okay, status? Wow, level two and six. Okay, so we, this is definitely a grindy game. Um, I don't know why I'm surprised at that. Formation, arrow, victory cluster. By arranging your members in different formations, damage from enemies can be reduced or attack power can be increased. What What's the rules of it, though? Positions? We're gonna do that because Sailor Moon's in the front because she's so far the most powerful one. Um, I still have no accessories, so that doesn't matter. Uh, let's see. And then items? I guess it's just the items I have. Bandage. Use items. 300 HP, 50 HP, 10 HP. Okay, let's use that on some people. Um, she's hurting the most. And then Sailor Moon's actually doing pretty good, so we're gonna leave it as is. Okay. Okay, so this is the this is the actual game part of the game. Uh, let's save now. Page seven. God, there's gonna be like 200 pages or whatever, just like save files. All right, let's 
continue on with this. Um, where are we going? I think we're just kind of exploring. Um, yeah, here we go. Uh, oh, wow. Jumo. That's another. These are all season one enemies, I think. God, it's been so long since I even thought about this show. We want multiple, so I guess we're just gonna do most powerful. It's weird that she can only do single attacks. Um, in the back, I guess. And then, yeah, multiple, yeah. So I guess if you're in the front, then they attack you more? Is that what this does? Look, if there's one thing that will always be consistent in video games, it's saving too much and hoarding everything. That is very on on brand, if you will. Uh, I guess she can't do anything else. So we're gonna punch. Uh, and world shaking. I think Samus is gonna one hit this though. Yeah, here we go. Woohoo! Did I level up? Saturn level up. Thank God, she needed it. This might be a game that less like off stream I go and grind, cause like without grinding, I feel like we're gonna we're gonna be hurting. Um, golly. And with exploring, I'm just gonna continue grinding. Wait, does that mean I can pull up the stream stream bingo and modify it to fit this? I mean, probably. Stream bingo, uh, probably is gonna be pretty consistent across all streams, minus Ogren being gross, if I remember the thing right. Uh. Or saving too much and hoarding everything sells the next big TLC reality show. Honestly, a little bit. It wouldn't be a JRPG if you didn't have to grind. That is very, very true. Uh, uh. Scouts are associated with elements, right? Like Jupiter's lightning? Yes. So, um, in the current lineup, Saturn with the weird can opener thing, hers is technically death. Um, it's represented by ribbons a lot for some reason. Um, the green-haired one, Neptune, is water, and Sailor Moon is, like, love and... Not really love, just, like, light, I guess is a better way to put it. And then Uranus is the ground, and that's their, their go-to elements. Um, Off-screen, we have Sailor Pluto, that's time. Mercury, that's ice. Uh, Jupiter, that's, like, lightning. Venus is love, and that's the, that's the lineup. Um... Chibi Moon is also light because she's like Sailor Moon or whatever, but for some reason a lot of her attacks use like sh sugar, I guess, for back of a letter lack of a better word. I didn't want single one or multiple. I'm gonna see if I can find any accessories, because I feel like I, I I should have them, but I'm not I don't have any. I don't know how to- I don't know what the economy is of this game. Like, am I getting a lot of money? Should I be spending a lot of money? I don't want to hoard too much. Uh... Man, Neptune's kind of the worst. Um... Like, her powers don't really do that much. Maybe- maybe when we level her up she'll get better, but for right now she is very, very cushy. She doesn't really hit for very hard. I like the demons with the tennis rackets. Honestly, that is li literally a tennis racket. Like, the plot of that episode is that some guy who plays tennis real good turns turned into a monster. Actually, I think it's a woman. Uh, a woman that, you know, does tennis real good gets turned into a monster. So that is literally a tennis monster. Um, the red one is technically like a computer teacher, and it, it, this is kind of the more boring enemies. Um, and then there's this one that's like this weird brown character thing. That's technically supposed to be a ball-jointed doll monster. That's that's that. And that's the T or something. I don't know. 
Dragon Age looks weird today. Look, sometimes you just gotta take a break from all the drama and play some Sailor Moon SNES games. More lore, guys. Pay attention. Yeah, I, I'm kind of refraining myself to just not like explain the plot of Sailor Moon to help you guys understand because I don't really, but I don't really think it's like completely necessary because I don't think you guys really care about the plot. You're just watching me make a fool of myself. And that's something, right? Let's do a single, I guess. So you got 520 yen. So let's say that's about normal. It's like 500 yen per per encounter. That's not too bad. Um, where are all the shops? Oh man, it's gonna get kind of annoying just to like try to find things in this map because there's no map. Oh yeah, there's the ball jointed doll one. Um, oh, I got more gems for some of these girls. Gonna be honest here for the voices. Yeah, see, you're, you're here for, for me playing it, not so much uh, the Sailor Moon deep lore that I know you guys are all so thirsty for. It's probably gonna be a little bit before uh, we hear voices, just because I trying to... That hit for two. She is not very strong. 500 yen is about $5 USA, so you're getting about 5 bucks for beating up demons. Well, that one's only 3 bucks, so... Okay, I want to go to the, like... Except oh, there it is. Ah, fuck! Right there. When can we expect the Dream Daddy <laughs> simulator playthrough? Um, I don't even have the game. Maybe, I don't know, if you guys want me to play Dream Daddy, I can look into getting it. Um... Golly, those voices are gonna kill me though. Uh, actually, wait, I want multiple. Demons are the end, it's more likely than you think. If you do the daddy, if you do, the daddy needs to be called Duncan. Oh god. That, that would actually kind of work because the daughter has darker skin, so like it, it would kind of look like. Duncan's kid. Oh god, now you guys make me want to do like a Dragon Age thing, Dream Daddy. Um. I thought. Welcome. Bye. Okay, here's some accessories. Here we will. Th these are actually pretty good prices, honestly. Okay, so we have. Ink speed up increases your speed. It's probably like attack speed. I don't really care about that. Defense up gives solid protection. That would be good. Yeah, just one, I guess. Necklace, defense up for smart dressing. <laughs> okay. Attack up to increase your power. That's good. Choker, defense up for wearing on neck. Okay. I'm just gonna buy one of everything. Who cares? How much? Oh my god, look how much yen I have. Yeah. One of everything. I have two of everything. Fuck it. Why not? Oh, I ran out of money. Okay, maybe that's why not. <laughs> okay, let's uh fucking pimp everyone out. Um. That's not the menu, apparently. How do I get here? Wait, what do I do? That's not the button. Nope. I want to get out of here. Okay, that's the button. Uh, nope, that's not it. How do I... Do I have to go to a... A little Luna Pea Ball to put items on? Um... No... What? Is this configuration? What what does this menu do? I'll be honest. I don't know what this menu does. Okay. What does X do? Okay, so X is actually the menu. It's not start. Okay, okay. I'm just an idiot. Okay. Um. Nope. God, this contr. I'm fighting this controller, guys. Ugh. Accessories. Uh, Moon? She would probably... Uh, oh, okay. It actually gives me the stats. I don't really need speed. Maybe 
Maybe she should be speed, defense, attack, defense, defense. Let's actually give her the uh, speed one because she's the strongest right now. So if she does the attacking first, we might get the thing over with. Then Uranus, we should bring her attack up. Do I have an attack one? Only one attack? Yeah, attack. Can I put on two? I can. Okay, so yeah, so we're just gonna really pimp her out for attack because that seems in lore. Um, Saturn, she has the lowest HP. So defense, I think would be smartest. We're gonna actually put two of those on her. She got some very pit earrings. <laughs> Uh, Neptune, I guess, is just whatever I have left over. So defense, defense, def a lot of defense. Um, we'll put, like, a defense and then, uh, speed. Call that one a day. Can you do three? Oh, I can't I can put three. Um, let's go back to Saturn. And give her another thing. So she's gonna be, like, super defensive. And then, I guess, just kind of distribute this amongst the, the, the troops. Uh, defense. That one. So you can only have three things equipped. Okay. And then just whatever I can. We don't really need her that fast, so we're going to put two defense ups. Okay. I think that's everyone. Okay, the chat and I agree that we would like a dream daddy playthrough with Daddy Duncan. Oh god, maybe I'll make Michael play that with me and so he can do some of the voices. Because I don't think I can do that many male voices. Um, Alright, let's get into this. Uh, Where did I want to go? We got some equipment. We, we're supposed to go home, so I need to find my way home. That's not the way home, though, I think. Okay, let's see how much better this group is now that we've done a little attacking. Forty-five. Oh, okay. I can dig it. No big deal. Do you get those equip backs when you swap characters later? That is a really good question that I do not know, to be honest. Uh, just spam it because it kind of saves my settings. Yeah, see, this is the way to go. Just have her go first so we can, like, spam through all these. Now, does she, does everyone get credit or does be, she the only one that attacked? We only get credit for her. Because that could be problematic. Okay, I think we're only my my home road now. Oh, shit. There we go. Okay, Saturn leveled up and she didn't do nothing. That's good, that's good. Uh, is that my house? I'm so relieved. It looks like nothing's changed here. Wow. Shingo? Well, wait a second, what's wrong? Wait! Oh. Imagine the Benny Hill thing playing. A Yoma? Whoa! Oh no! Everyone, transform! Nice. So are they just like all over my house now? Hey, Mom! Suddenly, all these monsters appeared and took Shingo. Please save him. Why, why don't you get out of the fucking house? Jesus. Uh. Oh, boy. Oh, yeah, I can go, like, super speed. I forgot about that. I don't think there's anything new here. I think it just... Once, I, there's, I don't think there's really any reason to explore. You just go after him. Uh, I'm assuming... Where do I go? I could just first door, I guess. Uh, we'll save, because we kind of did a lot. Uh, save where? 
Okay. Mom is being useless as usual. Yeah, really. Okay. Oh, here we go. Hey, stop killing my brother. Or not, I guess. Uh, hello? Don't. Don't. Don't interfere! Oh my god. Kerenny Green? What is that? I don't think that's from the show. I think that's just a random... Uh, I guess we'll oh, just go for it, I guess. I, I don't care what anyone says, these little mini files are actually pretty banging. I'm just gonna, yeah, keep keep going here. Oh man. Uh, hey, I got a lot of yen from that. Good, because I just <laughs> spent most of it. Thank you, Sailor Moon. It's all right, you gotta. What is that? Got, gotta, gotta, got. What is that word? Yeah, okay, he didn't know either. Gotta, ta da, da. Anyway, Sailor, Sailor Moon. Those people wanted to know where the silver crystal is. You mean the silver crystal? I guess he said like mispronounce it or something. Yeah, silver crystal. If you can't tell, I'm subbing some of these, like, more difficult Japanese words with, like, their English translations just because it's easier on me, because I don't really know how to, like, I recognize the word and what it's supposed to be, but I don't know how to pronounce it. So, that's that. Um, I guess I should save, because it's just a boss fight, but it really wasn't hard. All right. I know I played this part, like, years ago. Like, I, I played this before I even got married, to be honest. I was dating Michael at the time. This was sometime in co- Oh, what? I don't remember any of this. Oh, I'm getting a message from Luna on her cat phone or something. Sailor Moon, I found out some info about the enemy. Come to the Haikawa Shrine immediately. All right. Okay. Let's get going. My money for the April Fruits is Kitty announcing she's pregnant with Jam Jam. God, no. No, honestly, Katie, I would be doing the same thing despite wanting to learn how to communicate in Japanese. Yeah, it's just... Yeah, some of these words. Whoa, 148. Oh, shit. What, did, what do I have equipped on her? And I need to be buying everything of that. Um, uh, how did you get to the shrine? Did we take a bus? Is that what it was? I don't remember how to get there. You played this originally in college? Yeah, I played up until like... I. So later in the game, they're going to like split up the party. So you really only get to play like one member. It's really weird design. And there's like four parts to it, and I was part three, and I think after that was the end game. Um, so I got pretty far. Um, it, it, essentially, it was such a difficulty curve, I couldn't couldn't beat it, and then I just got busy with other things. And so like, yeah, but like despite having, I know I've played this before, I don't remember any of it. Does the cat speak through telepathy? Maybe that's how it works. No, the cat speaks because it speaks. It can speak. Like, it, the mouth moves and stuff. Um, if we're gonna get real technical in the deep sailing of Um, she's actually, uh... Kind of human? Like, she has a human form. Uh, this is more... I know there's, like, the whole Sailor Moon movie where, like, she wants to be a human and whatnot, and that's kind of a thing, but, like... Later on in the series, in the manga, Sailor Stars, Luna, like is a human and like can now just transform into a human as well as Artemis and Diana, the other two cats. So it's like, and they're apparently from a planet of people that are, 
half cat, half human type of thing. So it's this weird thing. I don't know. Was the American Sailor Moon heavily westernized like they did with Pokemon? <laughs> like rice cakes become sandwiches? Yes and no. Um, it was highly westernized, but they did still like set it in Japan. So they didn't really like change the... Um, like they, it was in Tokyo and it was like the Tokyo Tower and stuff like that. Like, they, they didn't really try to change anything in that nature, but they did change a lot of um, what would be considered socially unacceptable in the Western. Like, um, the, the the two lovers, Uranus and Neptune, were changed to be cousins in the American version, so they can explain the closeness away of just being, like, uh, like family relations rather than lovers. So that was kind of weird. Um, they also changed, like... Uh, so the, there's those four evil generals in the first season in America. One of them's a woman that has a love relationship with another one of the generals. In the Japanese version, they're both men. Um, so it's a lot of lot of uh, gayness that was uh, hidden away. They didn't even translate the last season because uh, there's like three very major characters that uh, present as male. For most of the show, and one of the, like, a big arc of that season is that he has a crush on Sailor Moon, but they're also Sailor Scouts that when they're Sailor Scouts turn into women. So it's this weird, like, gender fluid thing going on, and, like, America didn't even try to touch it, it just gave up. <laughs> so the last season was never translated into English. Apparently they're working on it now. Is this the shrine? What is this? Mycin? Oh, is this the tech school? So, yeah. Yes, because kissing your cousin is normal. They didn't technically kiss ever in the anime. I don't even know if they kissed in the manga. They mostly just, like, held hands and, like, was, like, hanging on each other. And it was very flirty. What is this? Is this... I think this is the... This is not what I want. I want to go to the shrine. This is not the shrine. I don't know how to get to the shrine. Oh, bus. I don't want to go to Infinity Academy. No. Well, how do I get... Is there a goddamn map in this... In this world? I just want a map. Please, God. Okay. Sailor Stars is my favorite. Sailor Star... Like, I've only actually watched it... I guess, I guess to say cover to cover once. Um, I It was really depressing. Like, Sailor Moon was always, like, had this thing of hope. And, like, Sailor Stars really didn't have that. So it was kind of, I'm going to use the word uncomfortable. Um, just because I, I, I wish it to be something you're not. And, like, I really hate, I really like Sailor Stars in the manga better than the original anime. Because the anime just, like, had this really weird twist in the end. A lot of things didn't make sense. Like, and, like if, if you've watched or read either one of them, the other one is just completely... Oh, God damn it. It's completely different. I remember the cousins thing. Even before I knew they changed it, I thought it didn't seem right. Yeah. It, it, it was really obvious that they weren't uh, actually cousins. Saturn is my favorite, and that's when you see her the most. Yeah, Saturn. See, Saturn's my favorite too, actually. And like, God, I'm so pissed off that she never got a transformation sequence. We were robbed. Even in Sailor Moon Crystal, they've yet to give us like a transformation sequence, and that's like, uh, why not? Crystal, you do so many things wrong. Why not at least give us the one thing that the other anime didn't give us? <laughs> Fucking nerds. Little did I know that eventually incest would be the creepy poor thing, and lesbian relationships would be vanilla. Actually, that is so true. Do you think maybe Sailor Moon with the cousins started the porn thing? God damn it. I just want to find... I think... God. God. I just want to find the shrine. Uh. I feel like I'm just grinding trying to find my way around here. Oh my god, where is this shrine? Sailor Moon and Poor are closely related after all. Honestly, if you sit like, uh, I made the mistake of, uh, 
So I was trying to find like a, an authentic 90s era button that says no hentai because I just, I, those are so funny to me for some reason. Like this is a website obviously made by a little girl. Why does she need to put a no hentai button on it? So I kind of wanted to put those on and like put it on the stream for my little fake website that I made on the sidebar here. But um, I made the mistake of uh, searching because um, I remember one saying like 100% hentai free. So I Googled like Sailor Moon hentai free, but then like it's Google and it thinks I jumbled up my words. So then just gave me results for free hentai. <laughs> so uh, yeah, that was a mistake. And there's so much Sailor Moon stuff. Sailor Moon has been so sexualized, it's crazy. Okay, are you the shrine? I wish they gave you a map at the very least that you figure out where to go. Honestly, yeah. There might actually be a map, but the buttons are so crap. I don't know. What, I don't know. I've actually kind of pressed all the buttons and I've yet to find a map. Safety search on. Yeah, really. Incognito mode. I mean, here's the thing. Do I really need incognito mode? I live by myself. And if nothing, Michael would just laugh at it. Who cares? Oh, thank God, the shrine. Uh, we, we say that. Okay, how do we get back to where we want to go? Um, okay, let's save, mostly because it's kind of time to go. But I will... Uh, let, let's, let's just go do whatever cutscene's coming up, and we'll, we'll go from there. Um, I might, like, in between episodes go and... I, I don't know how much I'm going to do this. This is a talk for later. Oh, I'm transforming. We've been waiting, Sailor Moon. What do you know about the enemy? Oh, God. Artemis. I wonder if I can do for Artemis. Artemis sounded like just your cool uncle. I don't know how to do a cool uncle voice. I don't have any cool uncles. <laughs> I got cool uncles. Uh... Oh, okay, I'm thinking like boss. I looked up some info on the Crystal Palace computer. It appears to be that the enemy has arrived from the future. Huh? But the Black Moon is... No, no, no. These enemies are from beyond the time of the Black Moon. They have the power to manipulate time. <laughs> they use the time space door to get here. Seems they've come to the past. If we tell Serenity about this event... Then surely the enemy will close the time space door. They must be planning something in the future as well. <laughs> this is one of the enemies that are blocking the space time door. Jinx, I know I'm scaring you. It's okay. <laughs> and then next. Huh? The computer's making some strange sounds. What? Well... The computer must be broken. Oh, let me have a go. Uh, I am... Ah, I moved. That's really clever, Luna. Huh? But I haven't done anything yet. I am the opposite of sin. What the fuck? Wait, there's something weird about this. I am the opposite of sin. One of the Senshi who dischanged destiny. I shall kill you, annoying Sailor Senshi. I completely rule her destiny. Take a look at this! Sailor Mercury! Sailor... Oh. Sailor Mars! Sailor Jupiter! Sailor Venus! Chibiusa! If you want Lady Serenity and other four Senshi back, come to Jubon Junior High School. <laughs> Wanna kick your ass? We'll be waiting, Sailor Moon. Wait a second. Everyone, Chibiusa. Sailor Moon, that's definitely a trap. But they've got everyone. Are we just gonna abandon them there? Why, well, I, I didn't say that, but I'm not, not saying it. We should check out our enemy a little more. I agree with Luna. We don't understand our enemy's strength, nor their true form. It's too dangerous to accept their imitation. No, I don't think so. If there's a trap, we can just destroy it as we go in, right? Uranus, but... I'm going to help Chibiusa! Sailor Saturn. 
Even when saving the world, I can't just abandon my friends. A universe without the other senshi. I won't accept it. Sailor Moon. What will... What do you do, Neptune? <sighs> Not my loss. <laughs> okay, we've decided. Well, let's go to Juban Junior High. Oh boy. <laughs> this dialogue is so eye-rollingly painful sometimes. <laughs> hey, look, you thought Anthem was bad. Check out this bullshit. Oh god. Man, oh man. Okay, so we... Uh, can we talk to him? Take care! Okay. Oh, now we have Luna following us. Artemis, don't you want to come along? You, like, you live with Venus. This should be, like, a thing. Okay, it's it's about time to go, and these save points are kind of few and far between, so I think uh, this is where we're going to call it quits today. Um, I don't know if I'll continue this on stream. But what what do you guys think? Should I, should, do you guys like it? Should I continue? I don't know. If this if it's something, I will continue. Then um, this is like a every other week type of thing. Um, I do want to eventually get back to The Witcher, but The Witcher was so soul crushing for me. I just had to. I don't know. This this is much more fun, you know. Uh, <laughs> please continue. Thank you for this beauty. Uh, Bioware Sailor Moon game went. God, if they make a Bioware Sailor Moon game, I would just lose my goddamn mind. Um, okay, I am getting people saying to continue. If you still have a voice tomorrow, do it. If we don't finish this, I'm stopping. Okay, okay, okay. We'll finish this, but it's gonna take like a little bit. My dog is. Are you okay? Are you okay? I think she needs to go potty. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for coming. Um, because you all requested, we will come back to this. It's probably gonna be like every other week, so two weeks, like oh, two weeks from now, I guess we'll come back to this. But uh, thank you so much. This has been honestly a blast sharing this little piece of my childhood with you. So with that, guys, goodbye. <laughs>